And when I pushed her back, that's when she called me a black ass bitch, and I lost it. And I smacked her. I'm finna sue. Yeah, I will. I'm telling you. I'm, I'm not saying, just, yeah. Just to let y'all know, I'm suing MEI for racism. On June 5th, 2024, officers were dispatched for a case of assault. Apparently, a small disagreement between two co-workers suddenly escalated and turned physical. When officers arrive, they confront both sides to try and piece the story together, but that comes with its challenges. How are we doing? So where's my victim? Right here? Okay. Hi there. I'm Deputy Wells with the Sheriff's Office. So what happened today? Okay. Hello. Oh, okay. Very good. So, kind of walk me through what kind of le what led up to this. Um, one of the gentlemen on the racetrack, which is one of our processes, he brought in some food for a few of us. Myself, um, Bettina was one of them. I went and a couple others. I went to go warm up my food that he brought me, mm -hmm. which he didn't have to do. And she was talking trash about the people that I normally sit with, saying, don't telling him, don't group me with those people. They they're two faced. Just don't don't and I looked at her and I went, Really? Like like we're two faced? Um, and that's kind of how it all got started. Okay, so you guys, you get in an argument back and forth? I didn't, that's... Or what? Yeah, I okay. didn't touch her. Okay. Today is the first day that I've actually said anything to her. Okay. From day one, she has been nasty and negative, and she said that... When she goes to leave, they're going to have to drag her out of here in handcuffs. Okay. She hates it here. Okay. And she can't stand nobody, and she's gone after a couple of other people um, when she first started. I don't even think she's been here a full year yet. Okay. Um, so where did she hit you at? Mm -hmm. That side of your face? And because she went... Boom, and then boom, and then before that, I don't know if she smacked me or she went to go like shove my nose up or something. Okay. But she hit my glasses, and I told her, not the glasses. Like, don't hit my glasses. I need my, like I need my eyeballs. And right. Kind of. <laughs> so did like, she, when she hit you? Was her was it like a slap, like open hand, or was her like did she have a closed fist? I don't. Do you remember? All I okay. saw was and felt was boom. Okay. Okay. And you want to press charges? Yes. Okay. Because this is unacceptable. I don't care how much you hate your job. You don't go after another person like that. Right. I mean, we all hate our jobs some days. <laughs> okay. Well, do you have your license on you or an um, ID or anything? It's in my purse. Okay. Which is out in the break room. Okay. Can I get your social? So how this kind of works is I'll, I'm going to go talk with her. I think she's next door here. Um, I'm going to go talk with the other half, kind of get her side of it. Then I'll bring you both back if she wants to file out. Um, you want to file out a statement for me about what happened? It's kind of part of the process of you already have one. Can I get a copy of that? Okay, perfect. That may, that may suffice. If not, worst case scenario is I have to get another one for you on our uh, letterhead, but I may not need to. Um, so, yeah. Hello. I'm Deputy Wells with the Sheriff's Office. So what happened today? So I was in there warming up my food. Um, me and Darrell Harris was talking. Okay. And I didn't say nobody's name. I just told him don't put me involved in well, these people. Just a second. Yeah. He needs to get something off his desk. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. sorry. It's okay. So we're sitting in the break room here, and I'm telling Darrell. Uh, the real, I keep saying the real, the real. <laughs> okay. Um, the, about the food or whatever. Mm -hmm. And Shannon was like, really? And kind of got in my face. So I kind of pushed her back a little bit, right? Mm -hmm. And when I pushed her back, that's when she called me a black ass bitch. And I lost it. And I smacked her. I, only, I hit her twice. They saying, 
four or five times. No, I didn't. I hit her twice. Okay. When you hit her, did you like slap her, like open hand or yeah. closed fist? No, I slapped okay. her. Okay. I hit her like that and, yeah, I hit her. Okay. And then Tim was like, uh, why it got to be a color thing, you know, to her? She's like, I ain't racist. I'm like, that's the first thing to come out your mouth. Right. You said black. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I got a name. You could have been like, even if she would have just called me a B. Right. It would have been, you know what I'm saying? Yep. Like, it's just what it is. But you said black ass. You know yep. what I'm saying? So. Okay. And I lost it. I'm, I'm not, and I'm not proud of it okay. because I'm older and I know better. It happens. Are you willing to write out a statement for me about kind of what led up? I, did she write one too? Yeah. Okay. I wrote one, and I um I supposedly had weaknesses too. Okay. I'll I'll look at that. It may suffice, um, but if not, I might want to get another one from you. Just yeah. kind of uh, special about what led up to I it. Know. It's, it's just. Um, it's, I'm, I'm not proud. I swear I'm not. And I apologize to HR and my associates and my TL yeah. and my supervisor yeah. and management because y'all didn't. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Y'all, y'all didn't. Y'all not teaching us that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I don't want to put no bad name on the company. Right. You know what I mean? I, I don't know what I'm trying to say. But you, you Where do you live at? Do you I live in Logan? In Bell Fountain. In Bell Fountain. Yeah, okay. Um, Sorry. No, you're fine. That's good enough. As long as it's local somewhere. So, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, give me a second. Let me okay. figure out if your statement will work, and I'll be back. Okay? okay. With both stories on the table, now it's time to see whose version of the night holds up. Is it Fatina's last day, or is that just what she's okay? My, I mean, now I guess, you know. I, no, I, yeah, but prior to this, I guess she was. She told us that she was thinking about transferring to another company, and she evidently must have been talking about it at some point. Okay. Right. Right. Yeah, she said she wanted to move to South Carolina. South Carolina. Yeah. Gotcha. She's probably not going to be working here anymore. Oh, either one. Either one. Okay. Good deal. So, all right, let me run out there and grab that stuff, and I'll be right back. Yeah, that was a mistake. I messed up my whole life. No. I kind of did. I should have walked away, but... Well, that's a lot easier said than done sometimes, is, you know? It is, but I should have been. That's all right. She's cooperative. She knows she messed up, so... I'm guessing this is going to turn into more civil than anything? Uh, maybe. She's probably going to go to jail because you can't do that, but... Yeah. Um, can't? Oh. I know, right? If only. If only. <laughs> Uh, yeah, right? <laughs> so, but yeah. We're going to let her go in first? That's up to you. She's probably going to end up coming with me. Yeah. Um, I just we, know. we would rather get her off property first. Okay, yeah, I figured as much. Her husband is coming to pick her up. He's okay. Going to avoid that yep. Okay, whatever yep. works best for you. I just need to um, go over what's happening on my side. Yeah, so yeah, you absolutely. And yep, I'm just what you need to do, and then let me know when that's gone. And normally, when I call you guys out here, it's never fun. I know, usually, it's just suicidal people. Yeah, that's first yeah. shift. Second shift, it's usually, hey, we have someone who's a little intoxicated and they want to drive home. <laughs> yeah, right. somebody, somebody just jumps on you in the parking lot. You don't know who, though. <laughs> With all the pieces of the puzzle in place, it's time for the officers to break the news. Let's see how our two overworked co-workers handle the verdict. Fingers crossed, no one throws another punch. What all is pressing charges going to be entitled for me? So for you, that would mean, um, obviously, she'd get charged with assault. She'd go to jail. Um, and then when time comes for if she um, goes to trial, um, that would lead to you showing up to any court hearings or anything like that as far as the, the court proceeds. Um, so like if she pled not guilty and went to trial, um, you'd probably have to go and testify along with me and, and whoever else that was here. Um, obviously she's getting fired from here, um, but so that's, that's kind of, she would be arrested for assault. Now you don't have, to, it's up to you. You don't. Charges okay. Because that is unacceptable. It even states. I agree. You contract. can't do that. It's even stated in our contract not to start a fight. Yep. It's not trying to start a fight, physical or otherwise. Right. And you just. Oh, and then uh, just your signature right down there at the bottom, please. Trying to stand up for myself. Yep. It. Yeah, believe it or not, you can't go around hitting people. But I've done. I've done literally done nothing to her. And that's. So that's how it goes sometimes. Okay, there's that for you. That's your copy of that. 
like I said, some people have trouble controlling their anger. Oh, and then this is just another little piece of paper with all your rights on it, just kind of broken down and explained a little more. Um, is there anything else that I can do for you standing here? Because um, obviously the next step for me is to get her out of here and uh, take her to jail. Um, is there anything I can do for you? Or any questions? If you have anything, think of anything else, just give the sheriff's office a call. Um, I'll give you my business card so you know who to ask for. Um, maybe. There's my business card. So if you need anything, have any questions later on, just give me a call. Um, if I can't answer it for you, I'll try to put you in touch with somebody that can, okay? So I will get out of here and uh, let HR do what they need to uh, with you from here, okay? Real quick before we leave. Okay. She wants to press charges. Okay, Liam, I can press charges too. Yeah, that's fine. Um, but just so you know, you're going to be under arrest for assault. Now? Yeah. Okay. If I could give you summons, I would, um, but I can't. Um, so. Can I smoke a cigarette? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, I don't want to walk you out of here in cuffs. I would rather not do that. I'm, you, I'm you've been. Pretty, you've been straight up I'm, with I'm me. I'm not gonna run. I, I'm I appreciate it. You know I, I knew I was in trouble, so I came back in. Um, so. But, um, I'm gonna put this up here. So we'll just do what you guys need to do, and okay. then. It's just my shoes up here. Okay. okay. That's on the way out. Okay. okay. Good deal. So you know. Yep. Perfect. And you'll have a bond, so you can bond out today if you want to. I'm in the freaking money. Well, it's an option. You know how high the bond is going to be? Huh? You know how high? It's we'll find out when we get there. I want to Yeah, it ain't nothing crazy. Yeah, that's nice. But I ain't going to lie. I'm finna sue. Yeah, I will. I'm telling you. I'm, I'm not saying the... Uh, Just to let y'all know, I'm suing MBI for racism. It is what it is. She called me a black head. Yep. After hearing both sides, the officers made their call. One worker walked away with a simple warning, while the other scored an assault charge. Oh, and as for their jobs? Well, both got fired. I guess that's one way to end a workday. Maybe next time they'll stick to water cooler gossip instead of turning things physical.